Step it up, it's not that freaking hot. This was battle. First here. For once. One of my guys already fainted over there. Just war is not really my thing. You can, as you can tell, I'm the weakest of the group. Not really skilled in this, these arts. All right, form a line. Welcome back, Let's brother. Go. Come Welcome on, man. Back. There's a spot right here for you. So you're gonna show us how to do this? I believe I'm gonna let you guys show me what you have. Raise your spears. There's your target. Wait, wait, wait. I think that's Thane's honors. I think this is you. Shut the hell up and raise your spear. Release on my count. Three, two, one. Release. <clears throat> Not bad, not bad. At least two of you hit it. Don't know which two of you it was, but it doesn't yeah. matter. Don't raise your hand. That was luck. So, uh, what next? Well, you proved that you're somewhat decent with a spear, so draw your swords. Let's do a little sword play. I've been fairly well trained, and I feel that they could benefit from my knowledge. Unfortunately, I have to be a little harsh with them sometimes. High guard, well above your head. Good. Plow guard, like the plow, that's right, you've used it before. Ox guard, the horns, nice to your head. Changing guard, dirty little trick, hide your sword hand. All right, this time we're gonna do strikes. High guard, strike. Ox guard, strike. Plow guard, thrust. Changing guard, strike. Good. Lang, pull your sword. Continue walking him through this. So are we gonna get real swords after this? Absolutely not. You don't have your own sword? We just don't have the money for uh, how much use we're gonna get out of sword in a year. I don't know how much damage this one could do. Well, you might stand a chance if you actually knew how to use it. Isn't that a poor reflection on our teacher, though? We've been babysitting long enough. Can we actually go do something? Fair enough. We'll put these men's skills to the test. Well, I'm an asshole to them, so I gotta be. I, they have to respect me. Otherwise, they won't help me. And in turn, I am helping them to survive. All right, uh, Sleepy and Langeth, you with me? You want Sleepy? I figured we could use a handicap. <laughs> Fair enough. We need our spears? Nice flat no. spot. No, no leave it's the not going to help you where you're going. <laughs> I don't think he can really do everything on the battlefield, he says. I think, I think if you put a fight between him and me one-on-one, -on -one, I, I wouldn't go outright and say that I would be the victor, but... Down here. I wouldn't want to be next to that in battle. Honestly, I would not be next to that in battle. I would be <laughs> dueling with my axe, taking people's heads off. You ready? Yeah. I think I'm ready. Okay. Wall up. Whoa! If we are invaded, we need every single able man to be out there. So, no. We need to be training these guys, and we need to get them prepared, which is the reason I'm here today. I feel a personal obligation because if they fail, I will go down quickly after. Advance. Advance. I mean, it's, you know, a group of guys working together, so it's not just everyone's individual talents that are going to stand out. We have to be able to, to meld, so. Advance. 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 I don't really want to go to war. I'm pretty peaceful here. Uh, war, people die, friends die. Seems unnecessary, but if it's to protect the land, protect the kingdom, we should probably do it. I've never enjoyed the idea of war, but at the same time, you got to protect your country and you have to protect your land. And I have an obligation towards my own people. I mean, we're not ready, by any means. 
fighting at the best of our ability, which if we keep training and we keep pushing forward, I believe with my men next to me, I have faith in them that we'd be able to fend them off.